What's up, carpoolers? Corduroy Paco's mobile vlogging unit is back. We are in full effect. So how's fall treating you? Have you gone back to school? Are you too old for school? Do you just skip school? Shouldn't skip school. Things over here on the corduroy side of town are crazy busy. As I'm sure you're aware of, you are part of a small group of people who actually watch these vlogs. I'll say straight up, it's discouraging a little bit, but I keep doing them. And like today, I could totally just say, you know what, forget it. I'm not gonna do the vlogs this week because no one's really gonna notice. But I stick with it. And I just wanna make these vlogs better so maybe more people will see them. That's my whole goal. And it's not because I wanna get rich and famous off of YouTube and I think that's the way I'm gonna go. Straight up, I like doing them. That brings me to this question. Say in the term of arts, how far will an artist go just to be able to do their art? I went to school for filmmaking and I have remained consistently poor in order to see that dream through. And it's not a dream of becoming rich and famous. Although that would be nice, at least the rich part. It would be a different vibe, like why not try something new? Hey, you being poor forever? Try being rich. Because I always felt like pe people are looking at me, like how long is he gonna hold on to this filmmaking dream before he grows up? But I don't see it that way. And for me on this side, it's kind of like, I'm never gonna stop doing this. I feel as long as you're pursuing a goal, you have the carrot of success dangling in front of you. And you sometimes feel like, man, I'm just wasting everything. I'm, you know, destroying my credit. I don't really get to go anywhere on vacation. Every place I live is rented. And if I just say, look, I'm gonna give up. I'm not gonna do the filmmaking dream anymore because I don't think it's actually gonna happen. And then I take some other job, full-time job, salary, benefits, all that stuff. I'll never actually be that happy with it. I'll always be looking at the people who pressed through and made it and like, man, I bet I could have done it. Maybe I could have done it. Even if for whatever reason I accomplish nothing, and I'm just constantly that broke guy living in crappy apartments with no money, but always saying, oh, I've got this on the horizon. Oh, I'm working on this. Maybe this will be the big break. It's like, at least I tried. If there's anything I can bestow on you carpoolers, it's this. Never give up before you try. And so with these vlogs, I know not many people are watching yet, but they're fun. I think the people watching them have a good time watching them. I hope you guys stick around. Please, please, please on this one, just like it. It's not, it's not hard. You got your hand on the mouse anyway, probably. Just go down, like. And if you haven't subscribed, then go up, subscribe. You got your cell phone by you, check me out on Twitter. That'd be cool. So carpoolers, remember, check your mirrors.